Mr. Popper, I would like to tell you a story about some very special and unusual friends of mine. One September day, about a year ago, I wrote and mailed a letter to the explorer Admiral Drake. I just love his radio programs. About a month later, I was listening to the Admiral Drake radio program when, to my surprise, he said, This is Admiral Drake speaking. Hello, Mr. Popper in Stillwater. Thanks for the nice letter. Watch for a surprise. Signing off. Signing off. A few days later, a huge package arrived. What could it be, I thought? What the heck is that? It was a penguin. I named him Captain Cook. We loved the little guy, but he felt so lonely. I didn't know what to do at first. But then, I had a great idea. I would write another letter to Admiral Drake. Maybe having a friend would help Captain Cook cheer up. Just as I had hoped, I was sent another enormous package, and out came another penguin. Captain Cook thought she was the most beautiful he'd ever seen. It was love at first sight. In no time at all, our house was full of penguins. They were very lovable, but also very expensive to care for. But then I came up with another idea. I would train our penguins and put them in show business. Phenomena. Sometime later, we received a surprise visit. It was the Admiral himself. I couldn't believe it. After a long conversation, we decided to bring the penguins to the North Pole to breed there. Admiral Drake thought that I should go along for a while, since the penguins knew me best. Now, for the first time ever, there is a breeding colony of penguins at the North Pole. I can hardly wait to visit them again. <laughs>